Oh, you can't be cleaning my glasses. I have a friend named Ellie who wanted me to read a report on me to you. Oh, now that I can see you are little cuties. Okay, let's read this now. It's quite cool out here. Super Susan, a biography on Susan B. Anthony by Ellie Katamitori. My personal friend, there's me on a coin, which I was featured on on 1999. Okay. Susan B. Anthony inspires many people to work and never give up. Susan was famous for working for women's rights. Susan also works for African American rights and to control the abuses of alcohol. She spoke frequently to Congress to push for these rights from 18, oh, no, 1896 to 1906. Long time! Susan B. Anthony was born in 1820 in Massachusetts. Then her family moved to Rochester, New York when she was six. She lived there for the rest of her life, and well, I did. <laughs> Susan B. Anthony never got married or had any children growing up. Sad. Sad girls. Well, Susan became a teacher in 1873. Susan had a very strong religion. She was a Quaker. Susan went to school in Rochester, New York. She dreamed of being a teacher herself someday. She never thought it was fair that people with different sexes or colored skin should be treated any differently. Her religion believed very strongly that alcohol was bad. Alcohol is bad. In 1849, a group got together to try to give women the right to vote. Susan actually learned to read and write at age three. That's right, I'm done. Susan also refused to pay a fine of $500 for voting in New York. Susan's best friend and partner was Elizabeth Caddy Stanton. Oh, I wish she was here today. She would have made a joke on this film. Susan B. Anthony was the first American woman to be on a coin. I was featured on the Anthony Dollar in 1999. Of course, I wasn't alive then. I'm alive now, okay? That's just weird. Let's move on. <laughs> Susan B. Anthony worked for many rights, including African American, women's, and personal rights. She continues to inspire women to challenge Congress in the fights for women's rights because she is remembered as a history maker in the fights for women, women's rights. Susan B. Anthony is a great in independent person who did so many awesome things and still inspires many people. Yeah, that's me, people. Okay, let's read my citations. Citations. Naveen Palma, Susan B. Anthony, fighter for women's rights. New York, New York, Chelsea House Publishers, 1993. Ritama Lucia, Susan B. Anthony, Minneapolis, Minnesota, Compass Point Books, 2001. Thank you for joining me today on my biography.